Hey, it's Marshall from Going Gear, and today we're going to take a look at the Lumentop TD15 Terminator. As you can see, this thing puts out 420 lumens, which is pretty impressive considering it's using the Cree XBG R5 LED. So let's go ahead and open this up. We'll show you what you get on the inside. As you can see, of course, you have the light itself. I'll take that out for a second. And uh, here's the holster. Got some other stuff on the inside here, spare parts. Here's a little ring here if you ever wanted to take off this ring right here. Um, and get rid of the kind of tactical grip or the anti-roll ring. You can replace that with just a flat one. And then you also have a lanyard in here if you want to use a lanyard. We'll set that to the side and we'll show you the light itself. So this is powered by either 18650 rechargeable lithium batteries or CR123s, but we're going to use an 18650. Let's zoom in, you can see the light a little bit better. You see nice machining and anodizing on this thing. There's the reflector and the LED. Stainless steel on both ends to protect it. Nice sturdy clip. Let's go ahead and open it up and put in that battery. Show you the inside of the tail cap and the uh, battery tube. So 18650 battery goes in. Put that tail cap back on. Okay, so for the operation of this, lightly press the switch in the back. Gives you momentary. Click it all the way for constant on. And as you can tell, as long as you're just using the switch in the back, it's always going to be in the mode you want it to be in. It's not going to switch modes on you. But if you do want to switch modes, what you do is take the head and loosen it. And you can see you can switch between strobe and head tightened is max brightness. There's actually another mode group as well. If you loosen and tighten the head really quickly twice, so we'll do one, two, you can see it switches to a lower brightness. And then if you loosen and tighten the head, every time you do that, it's going to switch between three different brightnesses. So you have two different groups. You have your max brightness and strobe, and then the other group is going to be three different brightnesses. So you can set it up in whatever you want, one you want and uh, leave it there, and it'll stay there for you until you change it. So that is the Lumentop TD15. We're going to go and take this outside and see how it does outside. All right, so we're out here in some nice 20-degree weather. I apologize in advance for any sniffles that I have. You're getting two for the price of one in this part of it, but I guess these videos are always free, so you're getting them free regardless. But uh, we're going to be showing you both the TD-12 and the TD-15, uh, since a lot of people ask about the differences between the two. So if you watch both of the TD-12 and the TD-15 videos, you're going to see this part twice, so just keep that in mind. We're going to be comparing them to the big 4D mag light that we always use. And this shot is actually going to be the distance shot that I use for big and bright lights, but uh, these guys are some nice little throwers, so we're going to use the longer shot. So that's my house at about 50 yards away. You can see the mag light lights it up okay. It doesn't do too, too bad of a job. The uh, tree in my front yard, about 100 yards to the top of it. Can't really see what's going on out there. Um, I'm sure on the video you can't see anything at all. Even with my night adjusted eyes, I can barely see anything. So let's try out the Lumentops and see how they do. You can see nice compact little light. Actually does really, really well, even at 100 yards. Um, lights up. Of course, my house is nice and bright. I can see all the details. Even that tree 100 yards away, I can make out all the individual parts of it really, really well. So that's the TD-12 on high. Let's try the TD-15. You can see it's even more concentrated, even brighter. Um, this is only 100 yards. Both of these could do more than 100 yards. Uh, you can see it doesn't light up a whole lot of stuff around that hot spot, and it's not really meant to. It's meant to light up stuff at a distance. These are definitely made to be throwers. So uh, keep that in mind if you're looking for something, a flood kind of light, uh, these aren't it. So we'll show them side by side. That's the TD-15 on the left, TD-12 on the right. At these kind of distances, you're honestly probably not going to notice a whole ton of difference. But uh, out at larger dif distances beyond the, uh, beyond the uh, 100 yards, that's when you'll start seeing some differences in the uh, brightness of the TD-15. You'll see it start pulling ahead. So that is the Lumentop TD-12 and TD-15. If you have any questions, you can reach us in the comments or at goinggear.com. We do have a retail store. You're welcome to call us as well if you like talking on the phone. And uh, if you like the lights, you can get them from us at goinggear.com or in our retail store. And uh, if you like the video, be sure to subscribe. We're putting out new ones all the time.